Wrestling Syndicate, and it's continuing. Trent Acid, a fine young wrestler, he really is. You just use the phrase, fine young wrestler. I often use the, for, uh, the phrase, fine young. Listen, I'm not the one whose sexuality is in question, question here tonight, Nate Stein. I'm the one even fine and young that I I don't know, you were really into black machizo sculpted knees. You're damn right I was. And you know what? You should get, get your fat ass back in the gym and get yourself some nice sculpted knees. You're just jealous. Hey, I go to the gym. My problem is I go out to eat after I go to the gym. I hear you on that one. We can agree on that. I really can't call tonight's match, though. Trent Axon, Just Incredible, Sabu. I mean... I'm on the radio every day. I'm a hobnobbing with Kanye West, 50 Cent. I don't have time to hang up with Danny Doreen. That's the guy's name. I don't know what to say to you, Peter Rosenberg. I just, I just honestly... Wow. As Sabu has entered the building in Garfield, New Jersey. To a lot of love.
Road, who's just, you know, been around the business, back and forth. To the, he's been to the top of the mountain. I mean, absolutely. What a, whoa! Maybe what a close line from Danny Doring. I got a cover from Ch Ch Chaz, one, two. Hey, I got news for you, okay? Yes, sir. I've seen Sabu give a 500 pound, seven foot giant a run for his money. You think there's a chance this guy's gonna lose to Trent Acid? With all due respect, to Trent Acid or Danny Doring? You know, I'll be honest, I'm really surprised you're throwing your support behind Sabu. You oh. seem like the kind of person. What? Incredible tonight. We are seeing just incredible tonight. And, and to, to speak to your point a moment ago, you know what? I have to respect Sabu. You have Danny Doring, Just Incredible, and Sabu, all from ECW, all in this now, one this match. Is, this is what people pay to see. This one, you, you cannot complain about two legends being in the ring together. That's the bottom line. You can say whatever you want about Sabu, the guy has proven himself. And there he goes with the chair. And this is what you have to respect. Because if you don't respect Sabu, he's going to make you pay. I guarantee it. Very true. Got that chair on the ring right now. It's, I guarantee this doesn't work out well for Justin Incredible. Oh, wait a minute. Justin Incredible stopped him. Oh, no, oh, maybe not. See, he's a crafty old man, that Sabu. I just faced him. Oh, oh, hold on. What's Sabu? Got that chair again. Oh, wait a minute. Lost his balance. He's going to do it again, though. He's going to go for it again. He's going to do it again this time. The second time. That's why it's called high risk maneuvers, Peter Rosenberg. Hey, okay, listen. Maybe if you got up off your ass out of the DJ booth every once in a while. Listen, I'll, say, some more I'll say this about the Sabu. He, he's, I'll say this about Sabu. He's, wait, hold on. Sabu just left. I heard Sabu say, well, forget them. And he just left. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, hold on. Hold the phone. Sabu is back. But he's not back by himself. No, he's not in a table this time. A huge, that's about 12 foot table. Wait a minute, I just saw, I can't really see from my vantage point. All the crowd standing on their feet. I think I saw Trinassi go for a Yakuza on, on Just Incredible. You know, it, this is the action the fans paid for tonight when they decided to come set foot in the trashiest town in the Northeast. The, the match that was the cost Look at you. of the admission alone. Of the cost of admission alone. What a mark you are. Up on your chair. Hold on, Trent Acid. I, just can't, I can't see the card. Oh! Trent Acid pulled off his head first right into the ring apron. The second I see Sabu get a table, I know someone's in serious, serious trouble. And that person is probably not Sabu. And here he goes. Oh! And over. And I heard a solid thud when he hit that table. Hold on. You know, it's, it's hard to see from here exactly what happened. I, I saw a fan say he, he hit his head against the table. Hold on. It appears to me from here that Sabu left off the ropes like he had so many times uh, in, in ECW and, and WWE. Only did not break the table but landed on the table. Well, regardless of how we hit, the crowd here firmly behind Sabu. And is Sabu still fighting his way out of that? He could have he could have been seriously injured. Oh there he is! There he's back for the ring. Oh and up again. Oh! oh, oh, oh. Does oh. not miss the second time! It's a guarantee Sabu ain't messing that up twice. You know what is Sabu? 65, 70 years old? Hey, now come on. Just saying, the guy's been in the business for a long time. I respect him, and he's getting up there. Sabu going for a cover one, two, but there's Danny oh. Doran. We haven't seen him in this match in a while. There's Danny Doran, ruining all the fun, like I said, for the jump. Danny was recovering on the outside. Now taking advantage of the situation, this is no DQ matchup. Listen, Grandpa Sabu. Odds have to favor this guy. He's still pulling on that head, though, which apparently landed flush on the table. You see Trent Acid, the international super superstar, rallying up the crowd here. Wait a minute, Danny Doring caught him. Uh, 
dragging him out. What's going to do? Oh! Bareback, right there. Dragged off the top row. One, two. Oh, they got a two count. Justin Curtis will break up the count. Now Justin Curtis is in super kick. Laying out, laying out Dory. Oh, has credible. Oh, here it comes. And you know what? That's incredible. Well, apparently now, the table that I thought, oh, oh, Sabu goes off the top rope with the chair, apparently the table was not broken. Three! It doesn't matter, though, when Sabu lands with a chair off the top rope, I guarantee you, you're not getting up. Score one for the old man. Yeah. The sound guy finally got the right sound cue, by the way. Congratulations to the sound guy. I think he's half a bundle of like... Well, half of him is. At least half. Uh-oh. Why is Justin just hanging out watching with that? I know he's not happy. Now, Justin did not expect to walk in here tonight to go against Sabu, Trenasset, and Danny Doring. He thought he was going to walk in here tonight in a two out of three falls match against Reckless Youth. Reckless Youth busting his shoulder off. Uh, and, and, and listen, when you come in expecting one thing, and what you get is a no DQ with Sabu. You're not happy. What great action here tonight at Pro Wrestling Syndicate. For all the, all the latest action, all the latest news, and, and everything you can learn about PWS, make sure you check out ProWrestlingSyndicate.com for all the latest. And guess what, Peter?